You know, we live in a strange world. And so it's important for us to draw our navigation from the realm of God. There are many ideas, there are many philosophies, there are many ideologies. Some informed by human intelligence, others inspired by demonic spirits. All of which are designed to shape this world and to bet a civilization that is alien from God. I just, come, I just came in from the western part of the world and the system is so designed that even if you want to serve God, it will be impossible. You will have to walk and work out your life to be able to pay your bills. Because the system runs on bills. So people walk. The moment the money comes, everything disappears. If you don't walk, you become a stranger. And the territory is not like this one where you say, I'm homeless. So I'm on the street for a while. <laughs> when I came out of the airport and stepped into the environment, I was embraced by 0 0.3 degrees Celsius. That is colder than your fridge. So you don't even have the liberty to say, oh, I I'm hanging around. No. So you must have to work out your life until you are able to pay your bills. If not for anything, for legitimate things. I'm not talking I need money for pleasure. I'm talking I need money to survive. A friend of mine relocated to the UK and he got a job. In a month, he was earning, I think, about 2,000 pounds, which is supposed to be, wow. He was in Nigeria earning that, I think, six months of the year. Now he's earning it in one month. You think he wants to rest? His house rent is 1,500 pounds. Meanwhile, this house rent, that's for a month, not for the year. That's what he pays for one year in Lagos. Now he's paying it for one month. And this is not a duplex. This is a room and parlor. By the time you remove light bills, you know, it's not like here where you say, oh, they have cut light, so I will pay any time I can. I will be in darkness for six months. Nobody will allow you. <laughs> so, <laughs> at the end of the day, you have to have many shifts to be able to pay your bills. Meanwhile, there are people at home who say, God has helped our son. He's now in the UK, send money. <laughs> there is no send money anywhere. <laughs> the money is not enough to survive. So we are in a strange world. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Every territory has its peculiarity. While you are in Africa complaining about corruption, in the Wesley world they are complaining about immorality. The whole system is informed by intelligence, superior to your mind, designed to create a civilization that will cut you off from God. And the day will come when God will become alien to your world. And when they talk about God, even if you are modest to receive it, God will become like a fairy tale.